Once you have completed your cart, you are ready to place your order. Let's first see how to place an order with the pickup option. The branch link to your account will be automatically selected. If you want to change it, click the drop down list and select the branch of your choice. Then click the order button at the bottom of your cart. Here you will find a brief summary of your order and the shipping option. Enter the desired pickup date and add notes, if necessary. You need to specify a pickup date to proceed to the next section. Then click Next. This page displays a summary of the cost of your order. For some accounts, a purchase order number may be required to continue the payment process. You can also include a file for this order. Then click Submit Order. Now let's go back and look at the second shipping option. If you select Shipping, you will be allowed to click directly on the order button without having to select a branch. You will then arrive on the checkout page. You can choose to have the available stock shipped in the next shipment or select a future shipment date. You can also select ship partially available on next shipment. This is a useful option when a product is back ordered and you want to receive the rest of your order quickly. The shipping address section allows you to choose from the addresses pre-registered in your account. If you want to add a temporary shipping address, check this box. A form will open so that you can enter the information related to this new shipping address. If you want this new address to be saved as a permanent address, check the Request Temporary Address to be Permanent box. The address will then be saved in your account and will become available for your next order. Note that this option is only available to users with the appropriate permissions. Once you have filled out the required information, click Next. You are now on the same checkout page where you can check the cost information and add a purchase order number before placing your order.